In this video, I'll show you how to increase your site's Facebook engagement so you can get more likes, shares, and interactions. This is done with Elementor's Social Suite, a set of Facebook integrations available in Elementor Pro. So let's get started. So the first Facebook widget I'll be showing you is the like button. So let's drag it inside and I can have the like button be relevant for the current page or for any custom page I choose. And you can see it shows the like count. I can also show it as recommend, which is the same as like, only different semantics, or follow. I also have a few layouts a button layout, button width count, and box count. I can change the size, the color scheme, add a share button, show faces, and that's it for the like button. Next up, we have the embed, Facebook embed. And this allows me to embed posts, comment, and videos. So first, I'll show you how to embed a post. So I have here this post right here, and to embed it, I hover over the date and right click, then copy link address and paste it inside. For comments, it's the same. Here's a supportive comment, hover over the date, copy link address and paste it inside, you see this comment right here. And for videos, Facebook were kind enough to allow me to show video URL. So right click, show video URL, copy it and paste it right here. I can show the full post. For videos, I can also allow full screen, autoplay and add captions. Next, we have Facebook comments. So if you have a page, a landing page or your blog and you want to add the ability for users to add comments to that page, you can have it by dragging the comments widget. And currently the this uh, current page doesn't have any comments, but you can embed any other page from your website and your users can comment on it. And you can uh, also order the comments according to uh, social, reverse time or time and display how many comments you like under the comment count. Finally, I can add our Facebook page. So if I drag it, I can see our uh, page. This used to be called the like box and it's really easy to add uh, as you can see. And I can show uh, the timeline, which shows all the posts from the page. I can also decide to show events. Currently, I don't have events, but if your Facebook page has events, it's a good uh, thing to show. And messages, if you want your users to send you a message. Also, th there are a few options here. Create a small header, remove the cover, uh, remove profile photos and custom call to action button. You can re remove that as well and play around with the height. So these are the Facebook widgets that we've added to Elementor. You have your Facebook page, comments, embed and like button. And you can use these widgets to make your site more dynamic, more interactive and more social media integrated. I hope you've enjoyed this tutorial. Until next time, this is Ben from Elementor.